guys welcome back to another video it is new year's eve um feels really weird i feel like this year has gone by so so quickly but i thought that i would bring you along with me today um it's not gonna be too wild i'm not going out i am staying home very much at home i am not getting drunk or anything like that but um yeah i thought i would bring you along with me because i filmed it last year but my vlog was rubbish i literally didn't show you anything um so this year i'm gonna make it a lot better i've got my makeup on i've been for a walk this morning um it's still really measurable it's really mild but it's so measurable anyway i've done my hair i've got this little silk ribbon in and we're gonna head to chelsea's and get biscoff pancakes whoop, whoop. and then this evening i am making a biscoff biscoff based banoffee pie that's a mouthful and yeah just at the moment i'm gonna get ready i don't really know what to wear um i think i'm gonna wear my i'm gonna wear this skirt with this brown jumper and boots um just quite casual um and this is optimal stretch for the pancakes and i'm also going to have a kids hot chocolate with it because their hot chocolates are amazing and they're made with syrup so they're just chocolate syrup is just amazing so much better than powder but yeah anyway let's get on with the rest of the day and hope you have a lovely new year's eve and new year's in general too on a side note, this morning's breakfast is my new favourite, so I've got golden syrup porridge and then I also put biscoff on the top, so it's really really sweet, but it's really really good and uh, yeah, I'm going to have a biscoff filled day, I'm having biscoff this morning and I'm having biscoff pancake and then biscoff banoffee pie <laughs> this evening, so I'm not complaining later um it's currently six o'clock in the evening um after josie's which by the way was absolutely insane I also got a biscoff milkshake and it had bits of um biscoff biscuits and biscoff sauce all in the bottom and it literally was so amazing very very sickly but very very nice and then afterwards we headed to the west we headed to West Quay, which is like a shopping centre near me, and then um, went to Morrison's for the first time ever. I've never been to a Morrison's um, because they have this cider that my mum likes that she wanted for tonight. Long story short, I don't like Morrison's. You didn't hear that. I don't like Morrison's at all. But anyway, um, I'm going to get this off because I've had it on for far too long. I've also got like makeup on. It doesn't look like I have makeup on, but I basically am not wearing foundation at the moment. Um, and I need to get that off and yeah then I'm going to make myself a drink we'll have hot chocolate at some point and then I'm going to make a, bano a banoffee pie which I did say earlier um, just because why not and then just uh, watch some films just relax I've been feeling really like but like there's a lot of unspoken pressure around people my age to be going out partying drinking with like a load of friends and for one I don't have a load of friends um for two I don't like drinking and thirdly also don't like dancing music loud noises I feel like I might have autism at this point but anyway um yeah I just I've been feeling like really like a freak almost I know that that's probably strong but that's not me and it hasn't been me and I need to be unapologetically me um and not get sort of like disheartened when I'm not doing that sort of thing it's particularly around New Year's um, I'm quite happy being at home um, and I just need to remember that but anyway that was a random tangent that I don't know why I went into but yeah if you are at home with me you're not alone I am also at home on my own well not on my own with my family anyway um, still gonna have a really nice evening we are having a takeaway tonight and then tomorrow we're having a takeaway because it's a normal Saturday night and we're going to the ivy and yeah it's gonna be a really lovely day i'm not sure if i will add that to this video i might do we shall see but i really want to get this off and i will speak to you in due course
Happy New Year, guys. I didn't go to bed too late last night. Normally we stay up and we know we watch the TV and the countdown and everything, but my dad was ill, so we kind of just went to bed. Um, and However, I did stay up until like one in the morning, so I am um, quite tired because that is unnaturally late for me. But anyway, um, it is the next day and I'm suffering with tiredness because I think, I feel like you can look at see it in my eyes, but anyway. Um, I have washed my hair so that's why it's looking like this, but we are about to go to the IV. Um, I'm going to be having scones as usual and my dad is going to be having um, brunch kind of thing because they do it really late. We're going to have cream tea at 3 o'clock and yeah, it's going to be a really nice day. I feel like a lot of places are kind of shut because um, it is obviously New Year's Day. Um, so it just makes it a bit more lively and yeah it is of course it is still a saturday so we are going to be having another saturday night which means another takeaway we did obviously have a takeaway last night but we are going to have one again tonight which is amazing um just because it is one of my favorite things at the moment but yesterday i had so much sweet stuff that this morning and like most of today i felt really kind of queasy and just ugh, I don't fancy anything sweet so um yeah I am hoping that I'm going to enjoy the scones I'm sure I will it's just at the moment the thought of anything sweet just fills me with a bit of dread um I basically had sweet for breakfast lunch and dinner and then had pudding um so yeah it was I still really enjoyed what I ate yesterday it was just I'm paying the consequences now but yeah um yeah I, we were hoping to go to Winchester slightly early, um, but it's raining again. Surprise, surprise! This whole holiday has been has consisted of loads of rain. But yeah, that's all I have to update you on at the moment. I will of course bring you along with cream tea, and then I feel like that's going to wrap up the end of this video because I want to get it up tonight. Um, otherwise, it's not really relevant. You know, like posting a New Year's Eve vlog a week, like in a week's time, is just not going to be what you want to see. Um, so yeah, thank you for a lovely year. Um, so yeah, I have been talking for three minutes, not entirely sure why, but there you go. I'm going to dry my hair, get ready, and then we are going to head to the IV.